two in the race who's got previous chasing experience and they're off for the EPDS Racing Welfare Novices Handicap Chase over two and a half miles, 14 fences ahead of them and it is Kavanagh's Corner who will lead them at the first and slightly dived at it and landing very steeply there was Le Cournet but landed safely enough and now they make the run on towards fence number two which is an open ditch. Kavanagh's Corner has got the lead Jumps out a little bit away uh, to his right over that. At the back of the field, Decker's Delight was a little ponderous and ridden away from the fence was Subtle Soldier, who at the moment is also racing towards the rear of the field together with Benny Light. So they race now towards the top of the hill with Cavernous Corner out in front on a long run now towards fence number three. Racing in second position is somewhere to be. A break then of about three lengths to grade A, who's on the inside of Lakefield. They're in third and fourth. And then Killin Akin makes the turn racing in fifth position. And then Arden Dennis is in sixth. He's racing just in advance of Le Cournet, who's in the vivid turquoise colours. And then Benny Light, who's improved a couple of places coming down the hill. Subtle Soldier on the inside out wide is Capsis Debois. As they go over the first, the trio of fences taken in the home straight. And having had a tendency, a tendency to jump slightly left at the first couple, Cavanagh's Corner now markedly going left-handed over the next couple of fences. That's left as we look, right-handed for him. A reminder at the back of the field for Subtle Soldier. On then towards the fence, which will be the last inner circuit's time. And through on the inside, grade A comes through now to pick up the running with Lakefield with the nose band and out wide Cavanagh's Corner. These are the first three. Somewhere to be is now racing in fourth. Killing Akin, the all-white colours, with on the inside Arden Dennis, and between those is Le Cournet. Those first six, those first seven, covered now by only about three lengths. And then there's only a couple of lengths to Benny Light, who's on the outside of Zar de Lef. Zar de Lef up against the inside rail. Out a little bit wider is Subtle Soldier. And then there's quite a gap opening up to the others now. Last but one is Decker's Delight and Capsis Debois has just gone past her, but they are both struggling at the back of the field. Indeed, pulling up at the back is Decker's Delight. She'll be pulled up before fence number six. So they're on the run now towards the first fence of six taken in the back straight. And Cavernous Corner has got the lead over Lakefield and on the inside, Grade A. These will be the first three as they cross over this next plain fence. There was a mistake there by Arden Dennis, who was towards the inside. And very slow and awkward over that was Capsis Debois at the back of the field. And Capsis Debois is tailed off. Meanwhile, the main body of the field go over the next plain one with Cavernous Corner still surrendering ground at each fence going out to the outside of the track but will have a share of the lead with on his inside Lakefield and then in the turquoise Le Cournet who's making ground on the inside of somewhere to be grade A is just drifting back in the field now and has badly lost his position as they go over the next fence taken down the back straight and pulling up at the back of the field is Capsis Debois. Capsis Debois is out of the race and now Arden Dennis is another one who is struggling badly at the back of the field. They've gone through their starting point and they've got five more fences to take and Lakefield on the debut for Kim Bailey moves to on the inside of Cavernous Corner these are still the first two over in third place with somewhere to be and Killin Akin is now in fourth Zardalef is in fifth and then Le Cournet is in sixth driven along in seventh is Subtle Soldier they're clear of Benny Light and then Grade A who just hasn't showed up today and neither two as Arden Dennis as now they make the climb up the hill and now they've got another three more to take towards the inside Lakefield around the outside somewhere to be these now the first two Le Cournet is continuing to stalk them now in third position Killin Akin is in fourth Zardalef making the run down the hill in fifth around the outside Benny Light is in six and these six now are a long way clear of the rest as they swing in line for home with three more to take Lakefield Dave back